Wars are won by the side that has the most fuel. But the next world war will be won by the side with the most electric power. Gasoline diesel fuel infrastructure is the biggest element of fighting any war. Millions and millions of gallons of fuel are needed for tanks, vehicles and aircraft. Months before any conflict starts, you need to have your fuel supply secure. The biggest department inside the Pentagon is a gas station. In World War II, the Allies targeted German fuel supplies. And their biggest headache to overcome for D-Day was how to get enough fuel from England to France. They did it with a pipeline. But that's all going to end. There's a far better way to fuel fighting vehicles. And as always, the solution points back to Nikola Tesla. Wireless power transmission. Today, some of the principles do stem from Tesla, but it's going to be very different and very much more powerful. This is the next World War scenario. Imagine a massive power station away from the conflict, beaming megawatts up to something that can reflect the power into the war zone. Satellites have been tried, but fail. LEO low Earth orbit satellites move, so they would need complex tracking mirrors to angle the power to the fighting zone. Geostationary satellites are far too far away, losing all your power. But there's a novel, better way. Aerogel drones. Tic-tac shaped, invisible, buoyant by vacuum drones. Fleets of them network together and long loitering over the conflict zone. Coated in metamaterial, not only to make them radar transparent, but to make them visually transparent. That technology exists today. The power beam will reflect off these multiple drones at 60,000 feet and beam down to collecting stations. Their flat antennas on the ground will charge massive batteries. Every car, every truck, every tank will be an electric vehicle. With massively fast DC charging, a tank can be charged in just a few minutes back at base. Maybe it has its own antenna and can pick up the electricity on the battlefield. Certainly drones and aircraft can be charged in the air. The next war will be fought with no fuel. It will be fought by radio transmitted electricity. So am I making all this up as I seem to do? Uh, no. DARPA are working on this system today. In fact, they're working on it yesterday. I really like sharing novel stories with you, but share your information with the world. In an age of non-disclosure, the truth really needs to be out there.